I'm going to wave the essential oil under your nose, and you can say yes, no, or maybe. Aromatherapy is the use of essential oils that come from plants, trees, and herbs. Yes. Yes. Depending on the particular so scent, the aromatherapists say the oils can work to cleanse, stimulate, relax, and even control pain. Our sense of smell is actually 10,000 times more than our sense of taste. And so we smell things immediately. Massage is the most popular way to embark on a sensory journey. Before you start, the therapist will likely ask you some basic health questions. Um, high blood pressure, heart condition. Yeah. Pregnant women should avoid aromatherapy. While more studies are needed, experts worry some essential oils might be harmful to the fetus. If you're otherwise healthy and opt for this type of massage, you'll likely be wrapped up so your body stays warm and your pores stay open. The scents are believed to stimulate nerve cells in the nose, sending impulses to the brain. It goes from the olfactory to the limbic system, which is our connection to our emotions in the brain. It's also the part of the brain which controls memory, and if the memories are happy, endorphins, the body's natural painkillers, might be released. The feet and the hands are the quickest way for the essential oils to get into the bloodstream. Studies on aromatherapy are ongoing. One showed lavender oil helped calm patients with severe dementia. Another showed pleasing smells might be a complementary therapy for managing chronic pain. Aromatherapists say they gauge its benefits by their clients' reactions. Toasty. <laughs> for WebMD, I'm Damon Maharg.